Hi everyone, it's Linnea. Today I have a card for you using a stamp set from the upcoming Beth Duff Designs fall release. This release will be available as a bundle on Friday the 21st and individually on Saturday the 22nd. There are some great stamp sets in this release. And today I'm gonna to be using the Cuddle Like a Panda stamp set. It has four different little panda images and a bunch of sentiments. And the great thing about this stamp set is that all the sentiments are separate. So you could build your own sentiment for your card, which I love. So I have that stamp set, and then I have a couple other basic supplies. I have a piece of watercolor cardstock, my Spectrum Noir sparkle pen. You could use Wink of Stella, it really doesn't matter. Or if you are not a fan of sparkle, you could just use regular watercolor brush or just a pan of water and a brush. I have a stencil. Mine happens to be the Puffy Heart stencil from Pink and Maine. And then I have some watercolor markers. And mine are the Stadler double-ended felt tip markers. But I encourage you to use whatever you have on hand. Anything will work as long as it is reactive with water. So if you have the Tim Holtz Distress Ink markers, or if you have Tombow markers, and even probably the real brush markers will work, the Artezas or the Zigs. And all I've done is I've taken my marker and I'm basically coloring in the outline of the stencil. I'm just laying down some colors and I picked a fairly simple color palette. I have some yellow, two different shades of a minty green and two different shades of pink. Whenever I choose a color palette, I usually try to stick to three colors and if I need to expand, I'll do a light and a dark version of that color so that there's not too many colors and it doesn't look all jumbled. So after I laid down all of my color, and all I did was just take my marker and run it right along the outside of the uh, stencils, or the, the heart shapes, and now I have my glitter brush, and I'm basically pulling in that color from the outline of the heart, pulling it into the center to color it in. And I love doing this technique because you have that hard edge to the heart, but it's soft as it goes to the inside and it really gives for almost like an ethereal look and I've chosen to use my Spectrum Noir glitter pen because it to me it's easy I would probably add glitter to this card anyway so I might as well skip the step of using watercolor markers with a water brush and then going back over it again with glitter to me it's just easier to use the glitter brush but like I said if you don't like glitter you sure can just use regular water and this brush lays down so much glitter. This card is so sparkly, it's amazing. So now I'm gonna build my sentiment. And like I said, all these sentiments are separate. So thinking of is one, and then the you is different. So you could do thinking of you, of us, of pandas, of cuddles. It's so awesome that you can do whatever you want. I stamped that in VersaFine Onyx Black ink and added some clear embossing powder over it. And then I have colored my little panda image, super simple Copic coloring, just some gray shading here and there, and I adhere that with foam dots. And that's it for this card. It is so bright, so sparkly, and just so happy. And I love this stamp set from Beth Duff Designs. So like I said, make sure that you check out the rest of the release. Bye!